Oh yeah, uh, it's just a bit of a quick one this. Um, I think I did a video on this a while ago, this Elizabethan uh, tape deck, uh, which was looking out for somebody. Um, I did say it would be best efforts. Um, uh, it's not gone as well as I'd hoped actually. Okay, let's crank it open. So I've changed some of the capacitors in there and tested it, everything wasn't too bad. I had a bit of a nightmare because on the cassette deck side there was a uh, one of those sort of like three pronged, three legged variable resistors for the tape speed. So it was running a bit slow off one of my test tapes so I thought I'd just give it a bit of a, a, bit of a tweak and the whole thing collapsed, uh, it was just it was rusted rusted to bits so it sat around for a couple of months and then ended up getting it back together again and sort of like ended up a couple of capacitor legs well one capacitor leg bent on one side soldered it fed it through and yeah it's kind of like hanging on it's working but hanging on done the case and everything it's not looking too bad it's better than it was before anyway but the annoying thing is, it is now, I think, about 20 to 11 on Saturday evening. I actually had to, re one of the belts that I'd replaced, um, I didn't have the exact size. So I chopped a bit out and super glued it. This was a while ago. It wasn't great. It's a bit too knobbly and the tape kept catching on it. So yeah wasn't fantastic so i did it again this morning and i've got another belt i've got a bit of a thinner one uh, chopped it out super glued it up i had to wait for it to be done so it's actually been out of the case now it was out of the case from about i don't know probably about half 12 till about eight o'clock and it's been powered on all that time just to make sure everything's all right not a problem i've not a problem at all it's been running fine um so put it all back together again left it on and when it's beyond it's, it's not worth spending a lot of time on this because these carbon tracks on the base and especially the volume just worn out i've actually the volume one i've actually taken that to bits stripped it down um given it a good clean with switch clean and everything put it back together and it's still as bad so yeah so let's see if it plays that's fine everything works great doesn't sound too bad from one of speaker So there you go, you think, well, you know, it's working, not a problem, is it? But, but, um, I put it back, I put the new belt that I'd made back in, uh, put it all back in the case, left it on for a couple of hours, nothing on the tape deck, nothing on the amp whatsoever, turned it off, turned it back on again, played on the tape, music plays, just slowly fades out after about 30 seconds so I can only guess I'm still working I can only guess that once it's back in the case there's something getting a bit warm in there but I don't know what so I'm just wondering if uh, if anybody's got any ideas um, is it normally 
of a mist of capacitors it normally the capacitors that get hot and just cause it to fade out um, resistors I don't know you tell me if anyone's got an idea you can bomb down in the comments I'll be grateful it's, uh, it's a bit frustrating to say the least I mean I can't exactly uh, send it back and say there you go it's great works fantastic as long as it's not in the case all right cheers